Well, good morning. It has been quite a while since I've done a day in the life, so I thought I would bring you along with us today. This is the first week we're doing all of our school subjects again. It's been three months, just shy of three months since we've done this. We've been doing language arts and math since we moved, and my oldest has been doing his science and civics because he does that on his own. And last week I added back in history and read aloud, but today we're adding in our Canada studies and our science, or not today, this week we're adding them in. So we're getting back to it because it's been a long time. So I'm just gonna do a quick workout right now. Um, the kids are just finishing breakfast and starting to do their schoolwork. And then I will check back in with you after. We've got two cats who are living by our, um, what's that called, shed out there. So we're waiting for someone to come and trap them and take them to a rescue organization. But in the meantime, we're feeding them. So I'm gonna go feed them right now. So this one underneath, we've named Callie. She's more friendly. The other one, we've named Sylvester, but he likes to hide more. You ready for some breakfast, Callie? Can I put it inside for you? Hi, you say hi? Hi, kitty. Oh, the shed. <laughs> you can see the cat prints. There's like no proper windows. So when we had a snowstorm, it got covered. Oh, she's peeking her head out. She's waiting for food. I have to put it in a couple of piles because she's quite territorial sometimes when the other cat tries to eat. Okay, kitty, it's there. You gonna come out? She's watching to make sure I leave. <laughs> She's let me pet her a couple times, but since we got her own cat, I haven't been trying. So I'm gonna go through the pile here, work that's already done for me to mark. I made banana oat walnut muffins yesterday, so having that for breakfast and going through this pile. Here's our cat, Hershey. She's still somewhat skittish. She likes cardboard boxes, so the kids have made cardboard boxes with a blanket like all over the house. There's a bunch of them. Right here, she. Oh, sweetheart. So I'm gonna actually go do some shoveling of snow because the plows came and put it on the end of the driveway before I have a shower. I've done all the markings so the kids will do their corrections, right, Ty? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm gone. It's super, super icy under the snow. I slipped a few times walking down the driveway. It's almost 11. Later than I'd like to start school stuff, you know, but life is life. Things happen and I'm a lot more laid back than I used to be. So we're going to go downstairs and do some Canada and some read aloud. But first, I can see my hair falling down. I need to fix that. Uh, I need to put a little laundry in because it is laundry day today. Correction. First, a major cleanup of this room. Oh my goodness. Meanwhile, can you spot the cat? She loves to hide under there. There's warm air coming from the vent. And she's kind of hidden. And she sleeps there sometimes. <laughs> She would have to take this hazardous path. What about the musket? Burden herself or abandon it? The danger below was not the type you confront with a weapon. Agility counted now. She hung the gun on a branch and pushed back her cape heavy with rain. I was able to get some bananas on clearance and these are the last ones left. So I'm gonna make banana pancakes. I'm just gonna use a mix today and probably put some blueberries in it as well. And that will be lunch while we listen to the news and um, Atlantic at noon, I think it's called. We've got four eating here. We don't have a table at the moment. We have a big open space. Josh is eating at the table we're using as our homeschool table slash food table over there. Lunch is done, laundry is done, so I'm gonna go give everyone their piles to fold 
I fold the youngest one or two usually, plus mine. And we'll get on with the day. So Ty is going out. Nate's already out there. Hang on a sec. He's playing over there. We're gonna go play in the woods. I've got my walkie-talkie in case I need to call them. I don't know where Nate just went. They usually have a little fort over there. It's 1.45. We're finally sitting down to do table work or school work. We'll see how long this takes. These guys are sledding out there. I'm gonna turn this off until I need to talk to them because it gets annoying. There's a helicopter. Flying in behind the trees. It was loud a minute ago. It must have come around the house. So there we go. Daddy behind the end is the that the bird wakes up the earliest and has the first pick of the best ones for their breakfast. Three kids down for schoolwork. <laughs> I had to stop and clean Katie's ears. We've got leftover banana bread, but some like plain and some like with chocolate. So we're just gonna have that for snack today. Doing math. Doing math. I'm making meat lasagna tonight. I don't usually make kind of something that takes this long, but it's like in between grocery shops, so. This is what we have, this is what I'm gonna make. You come in and Katie, there's a snack there. And then I, while I've got it in the oven, I'll sit down and finish homeschooling. Yes, I'll help you in one sec, Jacob. Math and English with Nathan. So even though this is a meat lasagna, I have always put veggies in. So we've got carrots, um, spinach, onion, and garlic in there, some cilantro. So I always sneak veggies in. Here it is all done. I'm just gonna put it in for probably 45 minutes. I just kinda do it bit by bit and see how it is. I don't own a lasagna pan one day, so I just use these. And this is for dinner as well as lunch tomorrow. I won't put the cheese on the top until a little later, otherwise I find it gets kinda dry. And I'm gonna go clean up. The kids are just playing some video games while they're waiting for me. And then go back and finish schoolwork while this cooks in the oven. The sun is setting over here. So pretty. So to answer the question from earlier, how long will it take to do schoolwork? It took till 5.30, but that's not typical and like the kids weren't at the table the whole time. So dinner's almost done. My husband just came home, we're gonna eat dinner and then uh, the kids have a online Lego club, the younger three, at 6.45 today for an hour and then we'll see what we do after that. The lasagna is done, and we've got some salad and fruit to eat with it, and this will be dinner for tonight.